What's up guys, my name is Calvin Wiley and welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to try to get bitten by Loxoselles reclusa, commonly referred to as the brown recluse. Now in this video, I'm not going to be focusing on much information about the brown recluse, but if you want to learn more about that particular species of spider, then I highly recommend you go and watch my first video that I made on them, where I give general information about the brown recluse. In this video, I'm solely going to be trying to focus on getting bitten by one. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. All right, so before I go ahead and try to get bitten by this female Loxuselles reclusa, the brown recluse, I just want to say a few things. Uh, so <laughs> it's kind of funny. I don't know if you've ever like woken up and just randomly wanted to do something. It just kind of sporadically popped in your head that you wanted to, I don't know, accomplish something, whatever that something is. Well, on this day, I woke up and I don't know what it was exactly, but I was like, I just want to get bitten by a brown recluse. I want to make a video of that. And I have no idea where that stemmed from. It could be because I've always... Oh, hold on one second. They're so fast. It's like crawling up my arm. One second. <laughs> uh, there we go. As I was saying... Um, yeah, so I, you know, I've always wanted to be bitten by a brown recluse. I just kind of put it off to the side, um, for whatever reason that was. But today, I don't know, I just woke up feeling good and just wanted to experience what it's like to be bitten by this species of spider. Many of you who are subscribed to my channel are probably already aware of the channel that goes by the name of Jack's World of Wildlife. If you aren't familiar with the channel Jack's World of Wildlife, then I highly recommend you go and check his channel out. He makes fantastic videos on animals, particularly arthropods and reptiles and amphibians. But the reason why I'm bringing his channel up is because he made a video a couple years ago on getting bitten by a brown recluse. And I just want to say that it is a fantastic video for anyone who thinks that the brown recluse is going to, you know, unalive someone with one bite. Uh, he's also been bitten by a species of black widow. I believe it was Latrodectus mactens, if I remember correctly. But we both follow each other on Instagram, so I'm sure he won't mind me shouting his channel out. But the reason why I'm bringing his channel up is to bring awareness of the fact that many people are deathly afraid of spiders, as you probably already know. Arachnophobia is very real. And his videos, as well as, you know, videos I tried to make, we tried to share with the people that you don't have to have an irrational fear to these creatures and other arthropods. Uh, the majority of them are completely safe and, you know, completely harmless. Now, for spiders such as the brown recluse and other species of spiders like species of Latrodectus, true widows, they get a lot of bad rep. Now, I'm not taking away that these spiders aren't medically significant. They do have, you know, higher potency in their venom than other species of spiders. But that's not to say that it is always a death sentence when one individual gets bitten by them. So, you know, the work that Jack does, as well as myself and others, you know, I just want to hopefully bring awareness to these fascinating yet beautiful creatures that though they may possess some higher potency of venom it's not always the you know end of the world if you were to be envenomated by them but again check his channel out i'll leave it in the description box of this video uh subscribe to him obviously now i'm curious to see how my body reacts to the bite uh his body as well as others you know everyone everyone's body reacts differently and so i'm like I said, I'm curious to see how my body will react to the venom of the brown recluse. So let me go ahead and get bitten by this brown recluse. Let's do it. <laughs> so really quickly, I just wanted to share with you guys my brand new line of stickers that I have available for sale on my website. 
All of these are various animals that I drew on paper by hand, colored them in, and then converted them into high quality, long lasting, waterproof stickers. Just to give you a quick idea of what they look like up close, here's one of my favorite drawings that I drew of a European Hornet. All of these drawings were achieved by using these markers to color them in. If you're interested in purchasing any of these stickers, you can head on over to my website, calvinwiley.net, or you can hit the link in my description which will send you directly to my website for you to purchase them. Thank you so much to all of those in advance who end up getting one for supporting my small business. And now, back to the video. Alright, so it's currently on my forearm. I didn't exactly care where it bit me out on my forearm, but this spot will be just fine. This will be the bite site. I'm going to be using my fingers to press the spider up against my skin so that it will inevitably bite me, leading it to inject venom. Now, I'm extremely excited about this and cannot wait to see how this turns out. So, yeah, let's do this. Here we go. Hopefully the camera is nice and clear. It doesn't go blur on you guys because I want this to be a perfect moment. Here we go. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> it moved. All right, let me uh, reposition it. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> All right, one, two, three. Come on. Oops. Come on. Come on. It's still trying to bite. It's like not going through my skin. Come on. I'm I'm really trying. It's it's not like trying to bite me. Which, I mean, is good because it shows the reluctancy of these spiders to deliver a bite. But I'm really trying, as you can see. I'm struggling here. Come on. Any day now. This might be the longest anticipation that anyone has been waiting for for a spider bite and it is literally not happening you guys see this right you're seeing this it's not just me i promise you what what is happening come on I, I'm not cutting any of this. This is all saying. Oh my gosh, and now it's blurry. No. Come on. You can do it. I, I have faith in you. Come on. What do I need to do to get you to bite me? I, I'm doing everything I can. Um, yeah, I, should I just post this video and say, attempting to get bit by a brown recluse? Because that's gonna have to be the name of the video, the title, because I'm not getting bit. Um, all right, well, I don't want to stress it anymore. Uh, I didn't get bit. You know, let I'm going to make this video be a lesson. <laughs> the lesson of this video is these spiders, the brown recluse, are extremely reluctant and are very defiant when wanting to bite someone. That's going to be the lesson that I got out of this video. Wow. 
All right, well, obviously this video did not go exactly according to plan, but nonetheless, I still kind of got a teaching moment from it. It kind of shows that not every brown recluse will bite someone. As you can see, they are, ext well, some, I would say, I'm not speaking for, the, for all of them or the mass majority, but some, as you can see, are reluctant to bite someone. Uh, now, this could have been a completely different outcome if I had another individual you know, they all have their own personalities, but who knows if I had another one, it could have possibly envenomated me. Uh, I only have one brown recluse at the moment, but I'm looking into getting more very soon. So hopefully in the near future, I'll be able to recreate this video and have one possibly envenomate me <laughs> next time. And so if you enjoyed this video, if you could please leave a like and a comment, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the bell icon to turn on post notifications. That way you're alerted every time that I post a new video. Follow me on Instagram at Kelvin Wiley and also on TikTok at Kelvin underscore Wiley. Check out my website, kelvinwiley.net, and I will see you guys in the next video.